Welcome to TwoFingerBanjo.com. I'm Matt Brown. Here are the picking patterns that we'll use in our various two-finger banjo songs, ranging from the most beginner numbers to the more advanced ones. First, I want you to pluck the third string with your thumb. And then you're going to play two short notes, five and then one. That's thumb and index. So the pattern is three, five, one, or thumb, thumb, index, thumb, thumb, index, three, five, one, three, five, one. Now a quick note about that. The first note, the three, that's likely to be where our melody note is. And the five, one, most of the time, those are gonna be just filler notes, drones, and things that make the music keep moving forward without actually changing where the melody is. So occasionally a melody note might appear in that fifth string or first string in this thumb lead style, but most of the time our melody will be on four, three, or two. So we've already done three. Let's try a fourth string. So you're gonna go four, five, one, four, five, one, four, five, one, and keep that rhythm so that it's long, short, short, long. Short, short, long, short, short. And let's try the other string that we're likely to encounter. Open second string. Later on, we'll put fretted notes in there. But for now, open second, and then five, one, two, five, one. And this is still thumb, thumb, index, thumb, thumb, index, two, five, one, two, five, one, two. The second pattern that you'll find a lot in our arrangements is one that includes a pinch. And when I say pinch, what I'm referring to most of the time is plucking string five and string one simultaneously. You could conceivably pinch any pair of strings. It would be with thumb and index while the others just rest on the head of the banjo. But most of the time, if I just shout pinch at you, I want you to default to five and one. So. Let's do this in a logical manner. Let's play fourth string and then pinch. Do that a couple times. Maybe four total times. So one more, four, pinch. Now let's do the same thing with third string as the melody note. Ready, go. Three, pinch, three, pinch, three, pinch. One more, three, pinch. Good. Now second string, ready, go. Two, pinch, two. And you'll notice the thumb has to do a lot of work. It's traveling between the melody note string and then back to the fifth string in time for the pinch, but there's enough time. Now let's do that in a quick sequence where you just do one of everything. So you're gonna go four pinch, three pinch, two pinch, and then you can do it again. Ready, go. Four, pinch, three, Pinch, two, pinch, again, four, pinch, three, pinch, two. One more time. Four, three, two. Our next picking pattern is exclusively made up of short notes, eighth notes, and you're going to alternate constantly between thumb and index. So let's start with second string. So you'll go two, one, five, one, and then we're going to change the initial note after that. So two, one, five, one. That's thumb, index, thumb, index. Two, one, five, one. Pause, and let's do the same thing starting third string. So three, one, five, one. Ready, go. Three, one, five, one. This might remind you of the Jeopardy theme song. Now let's change that first of the four notes one final time, and we'll have four, one, five, one. Ready, go. Four, one, five, one, four, one, five, one. One more time. Four, one, five, one. 
The last picking pattern that I want you to practice before trying any of our tunes is a combination of several of our ideas. So the first thing you're going to do is start on the third string and play our three, five, one pattern just once. And then you're going to take the pinch idea and incorporate that. Let's go fourth string as our melody note and then pinch one and five. That's going to be a measure of music in 4-4 four, four time, or, or the most common time signature for old time music. So 3, 5, 1, 4, pinch. That's thumb, thumb, index, thumb, and then both fingers. 3, 5, 1, 4, pinch. One more time. 3, 5, 1, 4, pinch. And once you can do each of these exercises comfortably and repeatedly, you're ready to learn our most basic tunes.